guys, it's Brooke from The Vintage Gardener. Welcome back to my channel. So today, I am doing a project I've been dying to get to and I, it needs to get done today. I'm going to be making a barrier for my driveway. So as you can see right here, <coughs> I've got trash cans blocking my driveway, which is not the most attractive sight. So this is what I'm doing right here. So I got four large flower pots. I got them from Flags Garden Center in Morristown, New Jersey, and I have them on um, caster wheels, as you can see, so they'll roll. And so I'm gonna be filling them with something called Eternal Fragrance Daphne. Um, and the scientific name is Daphne Translantica Eternal Fragrance. So I first saw this on, um, on Penrose Cottage's Instagram. He is a UK um, gardener. Um, and so this is hardy to negative 20, and I believe that's like, it's much farther north. I'm gonna say it's like uh, four, maybe, maybe uh, hardy to zone four or five. Um, and it gets two feet to three, two feet to three feet tall and wide. And so basically, uh, when I'm standing up, uh, if it gets to three feet, that'll be like up here. So it'll be pretty substantial, but it does grow. <clears throat> it says it's slow growing. Um, it's dense and rounded. Um, it has pink, very fragrant blooms. And so, yeah, so <clears throat> it says that it's a great foundation um, shrub and it's very hardy and tolerant of poor sandy soil so we shall see so i'm going to use for soil i'm going to be using some pro mix i'm going to give this a try it's their potting mix um, it's supposed to be compressed so it's twice that amount in there i'm going with pro mix this time because i'm using pro mix to do my chrysanthemum seedlings and so I'll see how that goes and if um it's, I mean they seem to be doing well the ones that I've started in there so I'll give their potting mix a try I got this from Walmart it was like $12 uh 12 13 dollars but it's cheaper than a two cubic foot pound um bag of uh potting soil so I'm just gonna get started oh one last thing before I get started I'm gonna be I'm gonna be messing around with different fertilizers this year because you know what I'm a very busy woman, I'm an attorney, um, so that's a more than full-time job than a garden, which can be, quite frankly, more than a full-time job. And so I don't necessarily have time to do weekly fertilizing of my whole garden, or even maybe monthly. So I'm trying to find organic fertilizers that last longer than a month. Uh, so one is, um, it's called um, Dr. Earth. And the other one is uh, Job's Organic. So there is this is a slow release plant food, and it's saying that I can go. I think somewhere on it. Oh, it says feeds up to three months. So we'll see. So for a container of my size, which is 16 inches, I need one and a half cups per pot. So I'm going to fill the pots up, then scratch this into the surface. So. Uh, I gotta go find my measuring cup and then I'll get started.
some um, mulch and put it on top of each one of them just to keep it um, just to keep it cool and keep the moisture in because um, obviously since I'm rolling them in and out of the way I can't actually attach it to my drip tubing. Okay, I'm going to wheel them in place and then water them. Um, I'm gonna turn the camera around so you guys can see where I'm going to put them. Uh, so since I'm home right now, I'm going to move them as far forward as like right here uh, because I don't want people coming this far into my thing because quite frankly, I got the impression those people would have probably, I mean, thankfully the trash cans were there and I think once they saw all that, um, I think they probably would have come all the way into my driveway had that not been there. So I'm going to put the, and like mind you, there's a big sign right there. So I have to get another one for this side. But I'm going to move them up maybe here, maybe actually a couple feet behind that white pillar. And then I'll water them to place and that way nobody will think to come in here. And of course once they get, you know, three feet high, uh, there'll be substantial shrubs. So, let me set up the camera again. Hey, you stop barking.
Okay guys, so that's it. So I will see you in the next video.